Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to prevent Google Chrome from blocking downloads. So in some cases, there might be restrictions on Google Chrome from downloading files onto your computer. So if you're having some sort of issue like this, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve it. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu, type in regedit, R-E-G-E-D-I-T, Best match, you come back to Registry Editor. Go ahead and right click on that and select Run as Administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select Yes. And before you proceed, I would suggest you create a backup of the registry. In the event that you accidentally make a mistake, you can always restore it back. So in order to create a backup, all you have to do is select File and then Export. File name, I recommend naming it the date in which you're making the backup. Set export range to all and then save it to a convenient and easily accessible location on your computer. And if you ever need to import it back in, all you would do is just select file and then import and then navigate to the location. So now that is done, we're going to start by double clicking on the HK current user folder. Do the same thing now for the software folder, so double click on that. Should be a policies folder in here, double click on that. And then finally there should be a Google folder. If you don't see a Google folder, you're going to have to right click on policies, select new, and then key, name it Google, and then right click on the Google folder, select new, and then key, and we're going to call this Chrome, hit enter. And now on the right side, you want to create a value, unless there's already one in there, you don't have to, but this value is going to be called download restrictions, so I'm going to right click in a blank area, select new, and then dword 32 bit value. Name this download restrictions. It's case sensitive here, so download restrictions. And if it's already in here, you don't have to create it again. I'm just showing it because I didn't have that sub key on here already. So once you double click on it, now we can go ahead and adjust the value. So zero will enable all downloads again. If you set it to number one, it only blocks dangerous downloads and two would block suspicious looking downloads. So there's different filter levels for how you can set it based on your preference. So zero will not block downloads. So select OK. And then once you are done with that, you can go ahead and close out of the registry editor. Now, I don't always suggest, or I don't think it's maybe advisable to block or prevent all downloads from occurring on Chrome. However, you're allowed to you know, do what you want on your own computer, on your own browser, but from a security standpoint, you probably want to keep it at one or two. You might want to look into more about it online in terms of what that value represents. But generally, zero shouldn't give you any nags about downloads, and two is going to block a lot more, basically. So and I believe it uses heuristics to detect what it determines to be potentially dangerous or not. There's obviously a degree of subjectivity involved, so just something to consider. You would need to restart your computer for the changes to take effect, no matter what you did. And there you go, guys. Pretty straightforward process. And as always, thank you for watching. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.